All right, what's up, y'all? It's 202 Wink. You see the title of the video? I'm on my way back to the office right now, so I'm gonna drive and talk. And uh, let's get straight into it, right? So how to get in the help desk and or cybersecurity with no experience. If you're new here, you might as well go ahead and subscribe. I already got videos on how to get into IT with no experience, period. And uh, for the help desk, that is. And so let's get into uh, cybersecurity now. So, number one, if you're already in IT and already working help desk, that'll be the easiest way to get into cybersecurity because, one, you're already in IT. So, at this point, at the job that you're at, you could probably either um, do some in house moving up, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, I know we got cybersecurity guys at my job, so um, you can either uh, shadow them, start asking them questions, shadowing them, uh, you know seeing if they have any uh, trainee positions opening, you know what I'm saying, something like that. But for the most part, you can shadow them and grow from inside of your job, you know what I'm saying? Or you can just start studying for your cybersecurity uh, cert or whatever while you're at that job if there's no room to grow in that department, you know what I'm saying? Now, for those who just don't have no experience, period, like I always say, you have to get some type of experience, especially if you're just trying to jump right into cybersecurity, but I suggest you start at the level, uh, the entry level, Joe, and start with help desk and then try to get into this. So at least learn your basic IT fundamentals. I think there's even a certification from that, from CompTIA. So learn your basic IT fundamentals, how to use a computer. You can, uh, you know, self-teach, uh, self-learn or whatever. You got Professor Messer, you got uh, the A-plus study book, you got Professor Messer, got a study book or whatever. You can do that plus you can go take a boot camp class if you want to get your cert or you can go to school take a six to nine month class like i did and um get your microsoft stuff and then get your uh help desk diploma or whatever but that's just to say that you got schooling for it and this and this and that so once you get your help desk uh once you uh you know get into some type of learning or program for it that's when when you get that under your belt that's when you start looking for cybersecurity jobs or even if it's just regular uh, cybersecurity job entry level the point is because somebody might take a chance on you I don't know I was just listening to the news the other day when they were saying a lot of these places are willing to teach you and they doing away with the four-year degrees which they should have been did people be going to school for four years for stuff that they, they could have went to school for nine months for like I'm telling y'all so um like I say online you could do some free courses some free cybersecurity courses uh you could just google that like i say youtube the point is once you get yourself some knowledge and stuff get you need knowledge and then you need some type of hands-on experience like i say you can always go get you an internship that's always uh uh a want you know what i'm saying somebody that's seen that you didn't work for nothing and you learned so that's the whole thing so long story short how to get into cybersecurity with no experience, start at the level playing field, learn your IT fundamentals, get your foot in the door, because it's gonna be hard to just jump right into cybersecurity and you don't got no type of background experience in doing anything IT. Also, make sure you have customer service. That's always a big thing right there, because you're gonna be working with people no matter what. So start from the base fields, get you some IT fundamentals in, get you like a little, uh, you know, get into a help desk job, get you some experience doing that. And then try to move your way up, whether it's in that company, other companies, uh, you know, do it like that. Also, pro tip, if you're, depending on your resume, once you get all of this, I also suggest adjusting your resume to the requirements and of whatever job that you're sending. So, yeah, you might have to adjust your resume to each individual job or a few. Or have a, a few resumes put to the side for you to, you know, use one of those that looks best for that also study your resume because you're going to get asked about yourself at your uh, interviews y'all so uh i'm gonna end that right here like i said this guy must have went to the woods to use the bathroom because i don't know what why he would just be walking out those woods but yeah so those are my tips that's what i think that's i'm already in the field so i kind of know how i go anyway so that's what i would do and yeah get in the it help desk cybersecurity, no experience they go like this you got to start somewhere start with your fundamentals build up all of this and that that's the end of this video y'all like comment subscribe share check out my help desk playlist